Oh my goodness, Sasha just had an appointment and we got some news for you guys. Again, I'm wearing the same sweatshirt, so quit calling me out because it's comfy and she keeps the house at about 50 degrees in here while she's pregnant, so <laughs> forget about it. Okay, let's sit down and talk about what the news is from that appointment. I gotta finish eating first. You watching me is gonna make it a little longer. Can you turn it off? No, any day. Gee, why? Every time we start filming, she starts stuffing her mouth with like the Because we always film in the kitchen. <sighs> right here. Food All right. Food. The battery's gonna be dead by the time we get to actually filming. Put it that way. Okay. Are you ready to talk about the disappointing news? Disapp What's disappointing? Well, I thought like we were really close to labor last week and- Oh yeah, we had a day where we had contractions all day, put it that way. Yeah, so that was my 37 week appointment. And then last week, or this week was 38 on Tuesday. Yeah. And I went in and she checked me. Mm hmm I was two and a half centimeters dilated. On this Tuesday, right? Mm hmm Two and a half centimeters dilated, 70% of face, and last time when, well, the first time around with Louie, you got checked at, what was it, 37 weeks? I don't, it's honestly, it's a really hard timeline to remember anymore. It's, it's something like 37 weeks and it she was, was three centimeters. Weeks. It was 38 weeks. He was born at 38, wasn't he? He was born at 38 plus three. Okay, so you got checked that same week and you, you were three centimeters and then you had him the next day? I don't know, that's why the timeline just doesn't make sense to me. That's why I don't Wow. So basically, Two and a half centimeters. This baby could be coming any day when I feel her tummy. It's very hard. Yeah. Feels like a, feels like a, how would you describe that? Like a beach ball? Yeah, I'm just not really in a great like mindset. Yeah. I thought this baby would have been here by now. It's already the end of the week. Today's Friday. We're filming this. I'm not sure when you guys are Put it this way. This. You boys have been on a very, very short <laughs> leash all week. <laughs> she has been. It's so hard being pregnant. I don't remember with Louie, you being as grouchy. grouchy as you've been this time around. Holy Especially smoke. Especially towards the end. I'm just really uncomfortable. I literally, like one day I was like breathing or something. She's just like. Can you stop? <sighs> Can you stop breathing, please? Exactly. Yeah. I'm like, baby girl, I can't, I'm like, I gotta breathe. No, it was you coughing. You just have this. Oh like, yeah, I had a cough. You have a, a not, what is it wait, called? Wait, 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 who gave me that cough? All right, this isn't a fighting match. Okay. This is an update on pregnancy, where we're at. Yes. So two and a half centimeters dilated, 70% of face. The effacement didn't change at all from the previous appointment, which I was it's, disappointed It's supposed in. to get thinner or something? It just keeps getting thinner. So I think when we went to give birth with Louie. I think it was a hundred percent effaced. Six Doesn't that mean there's nothing? It just means it's thin. Like it there's just... like a hole. Max, I'm not a doctor. I don't know. Go ask fucking OB. This is what I've been dealing with. Put it that Jeez, way. Jeez Louise. You're trying to be funny, but it's just- I'm not trying annoying. to be funny, baby girl. I don't know what I don't know either. There. I thought baby would have been here by now. So I am just tired of being pregnant. But at oh, the same too. time, I'm also like trying to enjoy this pregnancy because I know that it's probably our last. <laughs> <laughs> For me, it's the last. For her, in two years, she's gonna be having a fit when we don't have another one, put it that way. Yeah, I'm, I'm undecided. I make big decisions and then regret them a little bit like in the process. Like pregnancy was really hard with a toddler. Yeah, and like buying a puppy. Yeah, I just like to make really big decisions. She, oh, so I think the better way to put it is that she makes lifelong, like not lifelong, but like decades long decisions like that. Yeah. And we also have another thing that, when are we gonna announce to them? Yeah, when should we announce? Cause we're getting pretty far on that. There is another thing that we actually have in the works that it's a pretty big announcement. Obviously it's not like she's pregnant cause she already is pregnant. Mm -hmm. But it's a, a big announcement. It's gonna be a big change for us. We will be sharing that probably after this next baby comes because we don't want to take anything away from that. Mm -mm. And we will also need a lot of input from you all as well and things like that. So, so yes. let's talk about game plan. Game plan. What is the game plan? I am 39 weeks tomorrow. Yes. When is this video getting released? Probably on Monday, maybe Sunday. Who knows? Maybe tomorrow. I'll be like 39. And Tomorrow is Saturday. I'll be 39 weeks when you see this. My goal is to not have a baby on December 6th. 
Yes. Oh my goodness. That day is, would be like not a good day to have a baby because it's her mom's birthday. It's her brother's birthday. And it's... It's what, also your aunt's my birthday. My aunt's birthday, which we don't really celebrate my aunt's birthday. Like, obviously I would say happy birthday to her and stuff, but yeah. there's three birthdays already that we have. This would add a fourth. That's too many birthdays on one, literally one day. So if, if December 5th comes around and the baby still isn't here, you are sitting on your butt all day. On December 6th? On the 5th and the 6th. No movement because... Yeah. Okay. Wait, can, can I just, just agree that I have to do like everything? all day? <laughs> I'll Wait, take it. How do we undo this? <laughs> <laughs> but like in all seriousness, I'm trying to enjoy this pregnancy. It's just right now. I've never been this pregnant before. The most pregnant I've been is 38 plus three. And you're 38 plus five now? Six. 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 I'm That's 38 right. plus six. Tomorrow I'll be wow. 39. So I just... I feel heavier. I feel like it's just hard to get around. Yes. Baby likes to kick my vaheen. So like, or, or I guess punch since baby is head down now. And let's talk about how I'm feeling because of all that I've been it having to do. It doesn't matter what you've been feeling. <laughs> but no, I, I'm trying to just take in the last probably a few days. I'm hoping, fingers crossed, it's not a few weeks. Also... We did miss out because if the baby would have been born yesterday, 12 to 2021, it's actually the same forward and backward. It's a palindrome, which any birthday before December 10th will also be a palindrome. But 12 to, it this looks the same upside down as fast. it does upside. Like you can flip it around and it still spells the same thing, 12 to 2021. So that's crazy. Missed out on that. But. Don't put additional pressure on me to have a baby on a certain day. Just so as long as it's not December 10th, because if it's December 10th, it won't be a palindrome, but December 11th oh, or any other day. It'll probably before be then, December be 10th, the day probably. before my due date. <laughs> so if you don't know, I'm due 12, 11. So December 11th, which I believe is a Saturday. Well, I'll be darned. I don't know if I can go that long. <laughs> I just right now I'm having another Braxton Higgs. Ouch. I don't even know what it feels like. Don't want to know. If you guys have any guesses on when baby will be here, let us know. I'm shocked that I'm still pregnant. I thought by this point we'd for sure be done. I, who knows when the baby's coming any day now though. We're so excited. Thank you so much for joining us on this journey. And so many of you have been here from the very beginning, which is crazy. Yeah, like before we even got pregnant with Louie. Yeah, and if you've never dropped a comment, but you've been watching us for a long time, drop a comment and say hi. We would love to say hi. It'd be like really, that'd be cool to see because... You know what? I can relate because I am a silent viewer. I don't, yeah. I don't ever comment on people's videos. I just watch because I figure like, oh, they'll never see them. But like we go through and approve every single comment. Yeah, we literally or, hand approve every single one. Or because... delete and block you if you're a little... Exactly. Like booty butt. There's there's people out there that say very mean things sometimes, so that's why we literally read every yeah. single one. So drop a comment and say hi if you never have, or if you usually do on every video, keep doing it. We love it. Anyway, we gotta go pick up Louie. Wait, hold on. So drop your guess on when you think baby will be here, if they're not here by then. Oh yeah, that. And again, follow us on Instagram. That is the number one place that I go to to give updates. Like you probably would have known how dilated, how my appointment went, all of that. If you were on days Instagram. in advance, because we we film once a week so it's just really hard to get updates instagram's like, way YouTube. easier because you can just do it like right on your phone like yeah. boom there but it is youtube Super is easy. usually delayed by like a week if not more gotta edit the videos from the camera so anyway we gotta go run and grab our son louis from daycare so thank you so much for watching baby's gonna be here any day stay tuned oh i hope oh it's my not goodness any week it's any day at this point I'm probably gonna, gonna be late who knows be tomorrow or like tonight <laughs> Baby girl, I'm going to bed tonight. Oh wait, hold on, I do have an update. I have been mu uh, um, losing my oh. mucus plug slowly but surely. With Louie, it like, all kind of came out in one. I've just been losing it slowly this time around. You have been losing it slowly for the last Fine. few years. <laughs> all right, thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you guys. In our next video. Bye guys. <laughs>